modeling bookcases and bookshelves in Revit architecture has always been a challenge. Um, one doesn't want to typically model individual books on a shelf and then copy them around, and nor should they, um, as that would um, clutter up the model and cause excess bloat in the model. Um, but not having something um, representing the books makes it look unrealistic um, and makes it look, the shelves look empty. So a, an approach to making uh, renderings look more realistic when it comes to shelving and books um, is to apply a decal on a surface that's modeled uh, inside a bookcase or a bookshelf. So the first step to putting in the surface would be to go into um, go into the project model and basically do an in-place family. Um, so we go in here and we go to component model in place. We go and say furniture and maybe call it something like uh, let's call this bookcase. image surface. Something just meaningful so that I know what it is later. And what I would literally do here is come do and do an extrusion and basically draw something on the face here that I can basically put my decal on. So let's go and pick a plane and let's just put it right here. And then we might copy that uh, surface on down. And in 3D, we only need this uh, surface to be nothing more than just a very uh, minor surface to be able to apply our um, decals to. Decals are easiest placed in a uh, elevation view. So we can go here to the front view, go over to the insert tab, decal, place a decal. And we can just place this on the surface here, and it's going to pick up that surface. And then just uh, stretch that accordingly. Um, it doesn't necessarily have to have the proportions locked. It would just make our book's images appear a little bit taller. If we go to the decal types, we'll see that I've got uh, three different decal types, um, each with uh, a book image. And then I'll just place multiple instances of the decals on those surfaces. So once I've got the various decals placed on the images, if we go into uh, a 3D view, we can just kind of see that I've got those decals placed on the uh, on the surfaces there. 
So then we just go and render to see what the result would be. And let's go ahead and hit render. So now that our rendering is complete, we see our result. So we see that we've got some repeats here. Um, so a recommendation to get around to that would be go to any public library, take a straight on shot of uh, some bookshelves and then bring the image into like Photoshop and um, basically cut out various portions um, of the books and turn them into decal types and then apply those decal types to the surfaces kind of like we've done here and it adds an effect of realism um, to your renderings 